Let's start. Today we will see how to implement an indicator screener in the TradingView Pine script. There is no default way to create a custom screener in the TradingView, so this is a workaround for that. What we will try to achieve here is, we'll create an exponential moving average of 200, and try to find out which stocks are above this moving average, and which are below, on the daily time frame. We will display the result in a table. Let's see the code. This is the indicator function with name, indicator screener. Since we want to find out the 200 moving averages of various different stocks, and also need to find out which stocks are above the moving average and which are below, we will create a common code using a function. This is my screener function. This function accepts the stock name as an argument. First, we calculate the daily close value of the respective stock. Then we calculate the 200 exponential moving average of that respective stock, of the daily time frame. Then we find out if the stock is above the moving average or not. At last, this function returns this result. Here we have created a table with two columns and several rows. In the first column, we mention the stock name on which we want to implement this screener. In the second column, we call my screener function in the text attribute. The function tells us if this particular stock is above its 200 exponential moving average on the daily time frame or not. Similarly, we run this screener on a few more stocks. Since we have used bracket 1 while calculating the 200 EMA, so this indicator does not work on the current or the live bar. If you want this indicator to work on the current bar, use bracket 0 instead of bracket 1. Let's add this screener to the chart. As you can see, even though I am on the Bitcoin chart on the 30 minutes time frame, this screener tells us that the Tesla and MMTC stocks are above their daily 200 exponential moving averages. Whereas, Amazon and PNB are below their daily 200 exponential moving averages. We can cross-check this. By going on these charts one by one and plotting a 200 exponential moving average on these charts. As you can see, Tesla is above the moving average. Amazon is below the moving average. MMTC is above the moving average. And PNB is below the moving average. So, like this, now all you need to do is, add more rows to this table with various other stock names. And this screener function will screen these stocks accordingly. Similarly, you can create your own screener function with some other screening logic. The only problem is that the table in the Pine script has limits. If we show too many rows, the table overflows the computer screen and becomes invisible. So you can show only a few rows in one table that would be readable. It is basically a logistic problem now. If the trading view could provide a vertical scroll bar for a table, this logistic problem can be easily solved. But till then, this is how you can create a custom screener in the trading view Pine script. Thank you.